having a kindergarten class, they don't know how to research yet. So it's important that I spend enough time teaching what that is and what good research looks like. We take a little bit more ownership where we will find some of the sites and help them to get on because we don't want to spend 40 minutes just looking for a site or how do you type. So it will be a little bit more teacher directed for us at the first grade level, but it's going to look different by the time we go into spring because they will have figured it out how to do this, how to type how to do a, a bit more work with the device independently. The limiting of websites that they can access is really important. During the review phase, and I smile because some of the, um, the things that children have shared with us are actually very, very funny because their misconceptions are just amazing. In the weather, if it's cold, it gives you oxygen to stay alive. The cold weather has lots of oxygen when it comes down. But we wouldn't know they were having these misconceptions except for the fact that they're sharing them with us and with the class so we can address them. They oftentimes come up with great learnings, however. During this whole process, I walk around the room, um, help children if they're having trouble getting to sites, and especially with little ones, it's hard for them to read, so we'll sometimes have um, bookmarks on pages so they can get to it quickly. We will sometimes sit and read with them if, if necessary and guide them through the process. But generally, um, we're finding that the kids can work as a team. There's very little of that necessary.